Tonight we're checking out the only game where you can become the Uber of organ sales. It's GTA. Someone basically built an entire organ sale mod. And just like how Uber Eats delivers people food, we're going to be delivering different organs. Which, I mean, I guess people also might eat them. Obviously, you can see there's an entire list here, including a spleen and ambi- Dexterous male foot? What? Oh, and a left eye. All right, we're starting with the spleen, held by Harry Tony. Abandoned civilization moved to the wilderness. Still active on Twitter, though. <laughs> All right, now, obviously, as you can imagine. Wait. <laughs> Is this my options? I either get to have meaty bits or this moped? <laughs> Deliver targets and collect organs here. Oh yeah, there's like a whole harvesting area. I love how this dude is just smoking next to the organ harvesting platform. I'm not picking the bike, meaty. If you're here, we're doing this together. <laughs> meaty. <laughs> All right, meaty, I'll meet you there. What did this say? Hold on. Organ Trading Inc. Choose the order and find the best victim for it on the target board, of course. You guys couldn't have given me like a car or something? Luckily, there's gigantic numbers that tell me where I'm supposed- Oh my god. Search area for Harry Tony. Uh. What's this thing run on? Like 2D batteries? After running this thing down to almost nothing, I think I finally found Harry Tony. I know. You came to take me back to civilization and you might have good intentions, but I ain't going back. <laughs> I <laughs> Is this what? Oh, okay, now you're going to run away. All right. <laughs> have you been drinking like my deer? It's actually pretty fast. Hey. Listen. This thing has low emissions. Did he just jump to his death? Hold on. I got to what does this say? Okay, truce. I'm out of stamina, ball sweating like a gigantic sheet. Who wrote this narrative? Okay, so first things first. You don't want to hit him in the spleen. Actually, let me just get a couple of these just to make sure he's out for a good long time. There we go. Alrighty. Yeah, he's fine. Uh -huh. It didn't actually say how much I'm getting paid for this. Although I guess to be fair, oh, I just realized I'm gonna. <laughs> He's fine. All right, I got it. Sorry. I really hope I'm not running over the spleen. I don't actually remember exactly where it is. There we go. Perfect. You guys couldn't have given me like a backhoe or something? Now don't worry, that blood is actually the multiple packets of strawberry jam that he's kept on him. Okay. It's fine. All right, get one of the forks right up the groin here. <laughs> Ah! I'm gonna make this work, I swear to God. The spleen isn't by the head, so I'm pretty sure this will be fine. Oh, there we go. Perfect. I have no idea why they hired me for this. Wow, I made a mess! Okay, so now the trick is trying to get back without him <laughs> flying out of the boat. Hey, Harry Tony. <laughs> oh, God! Luckily, he's kind of like flat inside the boat, so even when I go doing full barrel rolls. He still pretty much stays in there. If you notice, see, he's like underneath the seat. Well, that's pretty, what was I He's kidnapping Tony, stop it. <laughs> I love that they put just random guys with guns around here while I'm trying to do this job. This is a very accurate portrayal. Whoa! <laughs> of what Uber is like. You still good back there? Oh yeah, and air. Anytime you see a gigantic arrow, that usually means that's where you go to get paid. Ow. Oh, he's almost fallen out. Okay, so luckily this guy's on the, the bank. <laughs> and we're home free. All right, organs deposited. How was it? Cancerously delicious. I was gonna say, I don't, I don't know if that's what a spleen looks like. Looks like a couple of scoops of orange ice cream. All right, I guess I gotta fill up the rest of these cells. I love that there's like the bloody handprint over here. Also, were you guys using like an eighth grade pair of shears? All right, spleen is in. We got a foot and an eye next. Wait, what is it? I just realized too, XXL color blue, but over here, yeah, currently works as a stuntman for Vin Diesel. <laughs> Finally, I get to meet my hero. Got to pick up our gun. All right, give it a little test. Yep, working good. And now, 
All I have to do is just look for the gigantic number that will point me to victory. Welcome to the maze bank. So wait, is this the alien or Vin Diesel? Well, I guess it's not technically Vin Diesel. It's Vin Diesel's stunt man. But honestly, I mean, if you get one eye, you might as well take the second one too. Hey, you're not supposed to be here. Uh, I mean, you planning on telling anyone? <laughs> <laughs> Let me grab the checkpoint real quick before I end up screwing everything. Why are there a bunch of motorcycles here? Am I gonna like parkour or something? Okay, hold on, yep. <laughs> Anytime I see a gigantic wall ride, that's when you know. Okay, Vin, you need to jump over the chopper, land on the second floor of a building, and then go down the spiral. I ain't doing this with my stunt man. I love that the person who made the board gave Vin Diesel that candy necklace that you always used to get when you were a kid. All right, Vin, here's how this works. If your eyes survive the fall, I'm taking those two. And yeetily dee, that was a two for one. All right, you ready for this? I can't believe he's afraid of jumping over a little helicopter. I've been jumping over helicopters my whole life. Yeah! And second floor, boom! Ah! Now I know why they gave me two motorcycles. And... Perfect. Hey, stuntman. Kidnap the stuntman by means of intimidation and deliver him to the base. Okay, hold on, I have an idea. All right, here's the plan. I'm gonna make you a little path to the car. Oh yeah. It's like one of those mansions with the fancy walkways, except my walkway is made out of C4. All right, get in the car. I'm actually kind of surprised that this worked. <laughs> Look at that, my pathway is perfect. Alrighty, don't worry, we're still gonna complete the stunt. We're gonna do this with a, with a, with a bang. Here we go. Yeah! Ow. <laughs> well, that was almost amazing. All right, take, take two. Okay. Oh my God. Oh! Okay, I vastly underestimated this wall ride. Mm. Okay, cool. You don't give me a lot of space, do you? I never thought I'd have to go through so much crap just to get someone's organs. Okay. Perfect. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Yeah. 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 Oh my god, I'm starting to get vertigo. Who made this wall ride? Okay. And around the Cheshire cat's tongue. Got it! Uh, I have no idea where I'm going! Ah, whoa. Well, I understand why Vin Diesel didn't want to do this. Okay, at this point though, I have the pattern. Yeah, look at it. Look at it, it's perfect. Beauty. All right, and then upside down. Hey! Yay! First try, yes! Well, it wasn't the first try going around that loop, but it was the first try trying to get through the thumbnail hole. So I walked up to, what the, how was it? It came off on its own. I love how he's got the gigantic freaking saw over here. There's the, there's the leg. He may have broken an ankle when I did that, that wall ride the first time I smashed into to the ramp. Will I take both of his feet? It's like a buy one, get one free. Okay, so that's, yeah, okay, so now that was Stuntman, so now it's the alien. Okay, so the alien is the eye. The Stuntman was the leg. How big is the alien? <laughs> Number three, find the alien in the maze and kidnap him. Also, this is the only item that they've given me to complete this task. I feel like it's not the best idea to have a baseball bat smashing people in the head when we're trying to extract eyeballs. Also, <laughs> notice how there's another <laughs> forklift. Oh, it's Meaty Bits. Where were you? You were supposed to help me with the Sasquatch. Rely on Meaty Bits' sense to guide you through the maze. Okay. That's Ooh. actually, I was going to say that's amazing. If you walk on the circle, Meaty goes ahead and takes off. Of course, he's drunk, so he falls down the stairs. That's right. Meaty is good at finding two different things, alcohol and aliens. They both start with A, so. This is actually the first time that Meaty and I have gone on a walk. This is actually the first time that Media and I have gone on a walk together where we didn't end up murdering someone. Well, I, I guess I did end up murdering someone, but you know, that wasn't my intent. Also, Media is not a pet, okay? He's like a member of the family. Why is, why is there a beer cooler here? 
Oh. Meaty. Meaty, we gotta- He's stuck on the beer cooler! <laughs> That's fine, I'm sure I can find this guy myself. Aha! Big circle! <laughs> really? What are you wearing? <laughs> Why does everyone trip when they try and leave? Oh wow, he's actually really fast. Ah! Uh, I don't know which way he went! <laughs> Meaty! I went into a dead end! This is really bad. I feel like I'm not going to get tipped well. Oh, alien! My baseball bat wants to say hi! <laughs> <laughs> Got him! Oh! All right, he's a little tougher than the last... Man, you really... Just... Just lay down! Lay down! Lay down! Lay down! You done? Nope. There. Okay, I think the alien is done. Hey. Right? through the portal. Oh, that's why it's only one eye. All right, Cyclops alien. Don't fall off of the forks. Um, yeah, he's fine. Raise him up a little bit. Perfect. Okay, so <laughs> what you wanna do is you wanna aim up. Here we go. You get a running start. Lower it down a little bit. Right about there. And yeet. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect! I'm sure the legs will go in when I close the doors. <clears throat> Alright, we're about to see if this works. <laughs> yeah, he's fine. Okay. I mean, I'm hoping this isn't a very bumpy ride. I may have to adjust him. I mean, he's still in the van. Alright, I ended up having to, like, <laughs> get him thoroughly inside of the van. Because as I understand it, it's time for an epic escape! <laughs> I love it. Give up the alien. We need him for research. All right, let me, uh, there we go. Perfect. Follow the arrows. Of course, there is a ramp with the van. Catch some air. The alien goes flying in the back. What kind of engine does this thing have in it? Oh, yeah. Are you ready? <laughs> yeah. If this alien wasn't dead, I know he's wishing he was now. Like a glove. Come to think of it, I probably should have put like a helmet on him or something. And through the teleporter. Three for three, baby. All right, so we've got the cancer spleen, the leg. I think that's an eye. It looks like a pool ball. Good job. I'll load the organs. You take them to the buyer at the docks. I love how they just shoved everyone in the same cell. Like there's plenty of... Sp what? What is this? You know what? I'm not going to worry about it. All right, so go to the docks. There we go. We'll take care of the goods. Come on board. I finally get paid after all this. I still don't know what the amount is. Go up to the containers cap will get you paid. Okay. And there's a whole, like a whole bunch of people here. Hey. Oh. I love that there's a space in between this board. So I actually have to go up here. There we go. In order to not fall into the nether realm. Don't worry, come closer. We're honest people. We've got 1,000 pesos. <laughs> that looks like a lot more than 1,000 pesos. Why do, why do I feel like the second I step on this circle, I'm going to get my organs harvested? Listen, guys, you don't want my liver. The alcohol's already gotten it. All right, here we go. Do it now. Ah! Ah! <laughs> why? I figured I would get betrayed, but guess what? I'm like the anti-Thanos. You should never go for the head because there's nothing up there. Now, meaty bits! And that's what happens when you betray Grey. <laughs> anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of GTA. Until next time, stay foxy and much love.